Marco Phelps. A bit of In the 2016 Rio Olympic Games, the red marks on swimming superstar Phelps made the social media rounds. A mysterious power from ancient China has become popular in the Olympic Games, cupping. In September, autumn was in full swing in Beijing. The cooler temperature caused a spike in the number of patients with typhoid bone pain. 24-year-old Li Chen Hui is a professional outdoor photographer. For this job that can show his talents to the fullest, he is always full of passion. However, the long-term overload work also made the young man suffer from a backache. A small jar is endowed with powerful force of nature by flames. Traditional Chinese medicine doctors believe that burning jars, exhausting air, selecting acupoints, and suctioning are the ways of compressing and congesting skin and flesh. It can effectively stimulate human meridians and acupoints and adjust viscous, detoxify, and clear away heat. In fact, cupping therapy with magical effects is not unique to traditional Chinese medicine. As early as in ancient Egypt, ancient India, and ancient codes and records in the spring and autumn period and warring states period in China, people can find the records of using animal horns as tools to relieve pain and treat abscess blockages through thermal negative pressure. However, the reason why cupping of traditional Chinese medicine can be different and have developed so far is that it has a complete and strong traditional Chinese medicine theory system as its support. Also in September, Shanghai, thousands of miles away from Beijing, was still in the sweltering heat. Many people caught a cold after exposing themselves to excessive temperature change. Zhang Shui Liang chose to treat their diseases by cupping. Zhuanyi是什么？从西医来看，它就是一个医学，一个实习，一个血管的扩张。呃，有经验的医生，他就会从火罐的颜色来判断它的病情如何。如果罐音很黑很黑的，通常中医认为它有瘀。如果有暗
、腰椎痛啊、颈椎啊、卡巴特诺啊、腕管综合症啊这种职业病啊、慢性病，是越来越觉得我们中医针灸。效果真的是非常好。嗯、um, ，I tried a lot of other different methods with、uh, homeopathic doctors, allergists, just regular doctors, and this is kind of the last resort. I didn't know what to expect, but it feels really good. 中医就是它是一个整体的治疗，不是说今天头疼我就 target 你这个头疼，你的脚痛我就光看你的脚。很多他的问题都是跟他的整体全身有关系。作为医生，都要从各个角度上，心理的角度上也要辅导他。啊，当然那个啊，这都是我们中医的那个优势。我们家做针灸医生可以做针灸、拔罐、中药、推拿、那个气功。啊，太极，我们都是纯中医，医科私药都不用。然后现在越来越多越多的美国人相信针灸，相信中医。With the continuous development of traditional Chinese medicine, today TCM has spread to 183 countries and regions around the world, and China has concluded special TCM cooperation agreements with more than 40 foreign governments, regional authorities, and international organizations. An increasing number of foreigners began to seek solutions to their ailments through traditional Chinese medicine, and generations of traditional Chinese medicine doctors have worked diligently to bring their benevolence and medical skills to benefit people around the world more and more widely.